What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here and we are officially less than a week away from the release of Call of Duty Modern Warfare and because of that, physical copies of the game are starting to be shipped out around the world to local retailers but there are some people out there who actually already have their hands on the game so we're going to be taking a look at this plus some details on weapon camos. I hope everybody is super super excited, it's that time of the year again, let's check it out. So I'm going to leave a link to one of the guys who has a copy and was even selling a few over on Twitter for 250 a copy, which is actually a fair price, I guess, compared to what I've seen from other people offer in previous years. But even then, though, the game's going to be coming out in a week, so maybe dropping 250 on a game isn't the smartest move to make with your money, especially since Activision and Infinity Ward have added some extra precautions to ensure that the people with early copies won't be leaking anything out because you have to install a patch to get past the main menu and the only way that patch can be downloaded is when Infinity Ward themselves launch it so there is this extra precaution that has been added and it's been done before in the past and usually Infinity Ward and the other developing studios will make that patch go live either two or three days before launch day so you really would be paying for um, a copy that's just a few days early but I mean hey if you have the money go ahead and spend it have at it I personally really do like this move though because that way we can all still have you know more suspense and more hype around the game it's also a little bit more fair for everyone too and also that way there won't be a lot of leaks and stuff getting out early and yeah although I mean if the PC players will have access to pre downloads then I could see the data miners leaking out some stuff there um, I did mention that in my last video talking about the pre downloads for modern warfare but honestly PC players may not even have access to pre downloads because of that risk so we shall see what happens, but going back to the guy selling the copies, don't think I'm promoting any of these sales because obviously we don't know 100% for sure if they are legitimate. Do go about this at your own risk, but I have seen the seller upload a video onto Twitter playing gunfight and even talking over the gameplay. He was even giving out the date too, so I mean, again, just go about this at your own risk and be very, very cautious who you give your money to. Moving on to weapon camos, Activision has shared on their blog detailing information about weapon camos. So as you level up your weapon, you unlock different base camos. But after earning those base camos, a set of camo challenges will be available, allowing you to earn a set of colorful and cool looking skins within a camo set for that weapon. In addition, camo unlocks earn you XP rewards. They also even say that each weapon has around 100 earnable camos, which are the highest number of camos ever in a Call of Duty game but it gets even better because there will be even something that's more than just unlocking camos that is only described as special camos for the players who are completionists and really like to unlock everything in the game so there's absolutely so much content coming with Modern Warfare literally it seems like everything has just been improved upon from all the previous COD games combined like it's really looking like Modern Warfare is gonna be a very good year and I'm praying that with all this content added the game is just just fun to play because it sure would be a damn shame to not really enjoy playing the game with all this content but of course this is going to allow way more replayability than ever before than I can recall in a Call of Duty game and I've been playing for about 10 years now so I'm really really hoping that all these camos look really really sick nothing too childish but at the same time hopefully something that's not plain and boring I honestly wouldn't mind seeing animated camos too just as long as they're not anything childish and silly I'm all for any type of design really maybe some classic flaw camos red tiger blue tiger etc um but please tell me what you guys think about this down below in the comments and also about the guy who has early copies down below again if you are thinking about buying those copies then be at your own risk because you don't know 100 sure if he is legit um you could also ask to like you know maybe hey send a picture of the um correct date and time or something i don't know just something to prove that he has the copies actually and they are working so again please remember that's guys thanks for watching love y'all so so much till next time i'll see you guys later